Hi, uh, this is Candice Moraga, and I am going to be doing a video on this lab. Let's see if I got it set up well there. Okay. Uh, let me just get my hair tied back here. I've got my long sleeve lab coat on, closed toe shoes, long sleeve pants. Can you see me there? Hi, Candice. Um, so I'm going to be utilizing the lamp uh, to plug in data because my hand is terrible in my hand, but or er, my journal. Um, we're going to be putting away the drink here because there's no drinking or eating while we do experiments. I've got a fire extinguisher standing by because we've got a burner involved in this experiment. I've got my distilled water. Uh, I had to get a bunch of different waters, so did some research on caffeine and those are some step process and not impulse distillation. I have no idea about data blue, couldn't find any info online. This uh, Glaso smart wires that we're using today. Uh, apparently they add some strange minerals in afterwards, but uh, according to the person at the store, all the distilled waters that they sell are like that. Well, in case of any spills, I've got baking soda, like the safety video recommended. Can you see that right there? Um, for any, I don't have kitty litter, but I've got some diatomaceous earth and some cornstarch, but I don't think we're going to be working on anything too strange today. Um, I've got all my materials basically ready to go here. Um, from the lamp pack, we've got our 100 milliliter beaker. Got all the lights on in here, so that's what you can see. Um, I've got the burner fuel here, which I previously mentioned. The burner stand. We've got the 25 milliliter cylinder. Uh, we've got a 25 milliliter volumetric flask here. Let's see that. Uh, we've got the Two, mil two milliliter serological pipette with attached rubber bulb there. We've got our safety goggles, we'll only be needing briefly in this experiment. A digital scale, 500 grams. I already uh, read the directions to make sure it was operational with the road out and everything. We've got 20 grams of sugar here. We'll also be standing by to cut that. We're going to be measuring that on this paper here. And we've got a, a meter of string. One meter. See that? I don't know if you can see that. Okay. Uh, we've got the thermometer, which came in the cardboard tube. Alright. Um, and we've got or metric ruler, because after all, this is an experiment on measurements today. And provided by the student here, of course, there's a white paper, a plastic cup I got from my camping mess kit here. Uh, we've got tap water in this sink. Uh, the distilled water I always showed you. We've got a delicious candy CD here. We've got Dulcita or Sarosa at our disposal, depending on which of them you like best. Um, let's see what else we have. We have a key. Oh, I took off my chiropractic keychain here. Um, let's see. We've got our spoon. We've got our fork. We've got five pennies here. We've got four dimes right here. We've got three quarters. And then we've got a pen or a pencil. And ah. Rubbing alcohol. You see at the convenience store. All right. Looks like we've got all of our supplies. Um, I've got plenty of bandages and first aid kits around in case we burn the place down. And I also made sure I filled out my emergency contact information here. 
put by the phone just in case. I had gotten a little vinyl tablecloth uh, for Liz, but it looks like this one's not going to be too diabolical. Um, we've got paper towels in case of crazy spills or anything. I'll see some rubber gloves around. Got more rubber gloves here. Um, and also a lighter, which we can need for our burner here. Um, ah, also we have our little baby pipette. We've got a bolt and a magnet here. Okay, it looks like we've got everything, right? Yes. Okay. Well, we're going to need later in the experiment some ice cubes, which is all we get. I'm making this video too long. Oh, it's already like six minutes. Okay, well, uh, you see I'm doing the experiment here, and uh, I guess I'm only supposed to have five minute video, so um, I'm going to start plugging in things, and uh, I guess you see that I'm doing the experiment here. Okay. Oh, I also have already important Thing. You know, all, all my pre-lab questions are already calculated and filled out, so that was actually helpful, and that's going to make this stuff even easier. Read through all the materials on here, and I'm just going to plug things straight into the lab report, the report assistant here. Um, we just have to attach a little Excel graph uh, with um, uh, I believe there's molarity and uh, density relationship. Uh, so I'm going to get to measuring. I don't want to ramble on forever here, but you see I've got the perfect lab. Signing up. <laughs>